Hi guys, I just got into my hotel room in Paris and the journey to getting here was fine even though the train was so fully packed that I almost couldn't get out but other than that I just got to, to my hotel and I feel a little bit down because the service at this place I know this I chose like a cheap place but the service here is so bad and it's like they get annoyed that you can't speak French but even though they know that I'm from another country and I'm coming here to visit touring the city and they own a hotel and they get so annoyed I just don't get that but besides that I got into my hotel room and look this is what they left me without the blanket this is what they left me with the bed and look at the stains at the the sheets is so disgusting and then they gave me because I asked them for a duvet is that what it's called a duvet they gave me a blanket isn't that weird and then the bathroom is all right I think my room is the only room that has a bathroom and that's about it but other than that it's so weird and then my, my view is this like dumpster place so nice so this place is definitely gonna be a place where I'm just sleeping and then as soon as I'm up, I'm out because this is really, really, really bad. This is so bad. And I need to buy like a blanket. I need to buy my own blanket to put on the duvet or not to put on the mattress because those stains are absolutely disgusting. And then on top of that, I, I don't know if, if you, Ooh. If you guys have seen like some of my haul videos, you guys know that I purchased these boots and I actually returned these boots and since I returned them, I have been thinking about these boots because I think they're really, really nice and sick. Um, I have been thinking about them and then I knew that I wanted to go to Paris. I was like, okay, those shoes are like a perfect pair of shoes to have for like, everyday use um, because they're just like simple black boots that will go with a lot of things and they're really, really nice to to wear for my outfits that I chose but they're so hard to walk in I don't know if you guys can see but it has a little bit of a heel and that heel is so hard to walk in I wore them to the airport and then I wore them to get here but I had to halfway from the airport to my hotel I had to take them off and then swap them to for these sandals. Thank God that I thought that maybe it would be a little bit hard for my feet to wear those shoes because um, I'm not used to wearing a shoe with a heel on. So I brought these in case that I wouldn't be able to walk in them every day. And I had to swap and then wear these instead. So I'm happy that I brought them but they're so hard to walk in. and I didn't even think that would be that hard to walk in, but they're really hard to walk in. So yeah, but other than that, um, I'm a little bit... It's like I have this... I don't have this comfortable feeling staying here, I don't know why. I really don't have this comfortable feeling. And then he also made me charge, already pay. I don't know, I haven't really stayed in the hotel for a while, so it's probably just normal, but... I had to pay for the days that I'm staying here, so now I've like paid for the for my stay here. So in a way, I'll have to stay at the, at this hotel. Maybe I'll get another place. I don't know, but I just feel a little bit uncomfortable, especially because the men down there at the reception they were so rude and not wanting to try to communicate, and I didn't even have like translate act. I don't get that. If you have a hotel and you're in Paris and you don't know how to speak English at least have like a translate app um, what's called a translate app so you can like communicate with your customers that is so weird I just, that's just something a little bit off about this place and also the area that I chose to live in I knew that it was a little bit outside of um, the center which is fine because I really want I've been thinking about moving to Paris and try to live in Paris so I really want to see like how Paris is outside of the beautiful center and the beautiful buildings and like see how everyday people are and how just 
the energy and how people move and stuff like that. I really want to see that. So I'm in a way that even though I wouldn't choose, to, I wouldn't want to live in an area like this. It's really nice to just see how that looks like. It's not a ghetto area, but it's one of those areas where I what I've read now after like a ride. It's one of those areas where they say like. To say that you shouldn't be walking in the streets at night, that I should be a little bit careful. Um, so yeah, it's one of those places, um, but it's, it's a, has a lot of diversity. That's the one thing that I really like about this place. So it's not like I'm sticking completely out, but it's different. Yeah. So now I'm just waiting for my phone to charge a little bit and then I have to figure out where I'm going next because I want to find a place where I'm going to eat and then I want to also just go around and film. It's raining today so I have to get an umbrella so I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film on my camera but hopefully I will get some nice shots and um, yeah, something nice. So yeah. Okay, that was it for this update for now. So yeah, talk to you. Okay, so I'm finally heading out. It's 12 o'clock. I slept quite a lot because um, I think I was really tired from yesterday and also I feel a little bit better by staying at this hotel even though I felt like it was a horrible experience I had when I got here. I feel a little bit better today but I think it's because I am also got a little bit of rest and I went out yesterday and walked a little bit around in Central and ate at a really nice restaurant and got also a drink. So. I think after that and having a good night's sleep that I'm a little bit better now. Um, so now I'm heading out to an area called Belleville, I think it's called. Um, and it's more like a local area but it should be a really interesting and good area and then there should be a lot of artists um, of what I've read in that area so I'm really excited to go there and see how that looks. And this is basically my outfit. I'm wearing my brown top and then I'm wearing a pair of new trousers, cargo trousers, um, as well, with my slippers that I got from H&M, um, which I'm so happy that I got, <coughs> which I'm so happy that I took with me because I do not think I'm going to be able to walk in these shoes um, for my like long trips. So now I'm heading out, and I think I won't be back after. Uh, I will be back like around in the, in the evening probably first so I won't be taking these ones on because they're going to be really hard to walk in when I have to go around um, so yeah so it's much better to have something comfortable so yeah so now I'm heading out and it's like a 30 minutes trip from where I am right now
Oh, 